Hello everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Violet, and in this episode, I suppose that we can do a little bit of exploring. I, I can also say that uh, I, I kind of went a little bit overboard when it come, came to, uh, kind of just looking around and trying to catch Poke any Pokemon that I could. Not really sure if any of these are technically going to stay on the team. The only two that I 100% know of is Habanero and uh, Wooper, which I still need a name for. I think I'll deal with that later. And not much else beyond that. Alright, let's just head into the school. We need to get everything for that done. Looks kind of nice. What the heck? What is with those helmets? The rest of the outfits are fine, but the helmets? Those just look terrible. Ooh, I like her bag. Alright, um... Ah, they're recruiters. Might as well. I mean, wh why would I not help her out? I don't even know who they are. Uh, yeah, no, those helmets definitely need to change. Maybe a different type of hat, though, would work better. Because the shirt, because uh, everything else about your outfits are perfectly fine. Hey, what? Oh. Okay. Is an excessively smug looking the uh, smug look on her face and I forgot to give the uh I forgot to give Albany oh uh whatever either way it should be fine seeing as how uh it might have been a little bit too uh, much uh leveling oh well, that, uh, there we go I wonder I don't actually remember what level he evolves at uh, should be soon, though. Very soon. Oh! There we go! Finally. Even though it's only been, like, two episodes for you. <laughs> oh, well. That's, uh... I don't know how I feel about that. It might grow on me, but for now, I just don't like the, uh, th uh the headpiece or whatever. That's beside the point. That's kind of your fault. Uh, hey, I'm not in the wrong here. Uh, that's not really what happened, uh, to say the least. Oh well. I mean, it's not like, it typically matters if you read the situation wrong. Just as long as it's not necessarily something that, uh, can be viewed as extremely bad. In general, uh, I don't actually know. Ah. Just like, more, uh, more like a weird Pokeball. Rather than anything that can be used like that. But it does make me curious how they operate, then. I mean... Seriously, though, those helmets. What is it with this game and uh, having terrible headwear for each and every single person? I mean, character design is perfectly fine for everyone. Beyond that, the outfit design. Jeez, it looks terrible. And so let's add uh, rascal eyes, I guess. Not really sure. Now we 
actually have a better looking... Oh, never mind, it just sits there. Weirdly awkward looking position. And they should have one-shot it. For two reasons, obviously. One, because I... Overlevel. A lot, actually. Eh, don't feel bad. Yeah, I mean, granted, you didn't really train up your Pokemon that much. And you only chose to have a single Pokemon on your team. Which really makes me question things, like, why do people, uh, why do people in this universe carry less than six Pokemon on their team? I understand from a gameplay perspective, but... In general, I shouldn't... Unless you're... Like, if you're planning on being a Pokemon trainer, basically, then you should have at least... I don't know... Four Pokemon at the least. Granted, I'm pretty much only gonna have like three as soon as I... I don't even know anymore. I'm just randomly spouting out about random things. Is that necessarily important? Uh, I guess, see so ya. Yeah. I'm not sure, not sure who she was, but okay. Yeah, I, I I don't even know. Let's just get up to the school. Yay. Also, this doesn't seem necessarily that bad. I'm pretty sure we've all been through war, uh, war, war situations or whatever. Like, as in... I don't know. Skyrim, the... Uh, I don't actually remember how many stairs it was, but it was a really long walk. So long, in fact, that you got uh, attacked by a troll and uh, sometimes wolves and other times... Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> the frost spiders or whatever. God, I hate those. Say out of a fear, uh, fear sort of thing, but that's beside the point. And I'm not really sure what else to say. Can we just can we get to classes? Oh, I know. Still, um, still wearing those offset colors. Um, I see. Actually, no, they're not really offset colors, but they just don't work very well in the sense of an outfit. I mean, yeah, uh, it makes you stand out more as a character. But at least change the pants. That, those could be so easy to stain. And plus, get, oh, okay, well, at least we know her name. I, I, I'm barely uh, paying attention. But as I was saying, those pants would be so easy to stain. And when it comes to getting that stains out, that's just gonna be terrible. It's pretty much you stain uh, any wet, uh, piece of wet clothing once and then it's never fixed. Oh. So he's our homeroom teacher. Hello. Students. I'm not exactly sure what's going on. I don't even actually understand how this school st uh, structuring actually works. Yo. Step though. How does this school structuring work? I, I don't even know what's being said. I'm just introducing myself. Alright, what's your question? Uh, I suppose that I like battling Pokemon. Uh, I suppose uh, it's about the largest thing that you can technically do with him. But uh, in the real world, technically speaking, it would kind of just be like having them.
Uh, well, I mean, I actually do want to uh, become a strong trainer. Why? I don't know. There is no end goal in this. Just kind of do it. Entertain my, uh, myself and I suppose others if uh, people are actually watching this. And I, I don't really know. Is that it? Oh, okay. First, I'll start off with the cafeteria and uh, talk to Arvin. I'm actually surprised that he showed up to school in the first place. Hello, my friend. Long time. Not so long time. See, technically, I don't really know. Yeah, from the lighthouse. Okay, uh. How exactly does word travel that fast? I mean, if it if it were something about dealing with Team Star, that makes sense. Uh, that makes sense. But how long has it actually been since this uh, school has started? Sure, I'm fine with helping. Ah, uh, me, I guess. I suppose that I kind of want to help people as much as I can. And, uh, what way to do then, uh, with someone who, uh, kind of, uh, who I trust. Alright. So, you want me to help you find some herbs? How long, uh, how long will that technically take? Yeah. What does that entail? Finding time and stuff like that. I need rosemary. I don't really know. Uh, well, there's uh, there's where that uh, Pokemon comes in. I can't remember what his name is at the moment. Sure, I'm down with helping. Alright, my friend. Ooh, I actually like your phone case. I think it's teal combined with, uh, whatever else. It's teal and then you customize it to have a lower end being, uh, almost like a light blue, which is kind of, uh, up there is a color that I really like now. And then also combined with Oh, well, there we go. I can get some money. I will. Now then. I guess... to... Oh. What is even happening now? Uh, yeah? How could somebody hack a Rotom phone? through three battles. How do I have serious potential? Never mind, four battles. How do I have serious potential? Yeah, I know what Seam Star is. How can I be seen as having great potential? I mean, sure, I beat Nimona twice, but then again, she was using Pokemon that she, uh, a, poke a Pokemon that she started using for the first time, and then the second one, she was only using two of her Pokemon. Which, honestly, she... Sure, I found... Oh. Oh, great. Uh, more stuff like that. Oh, hi. What's up? Yeah, I suppose that I'll try to be more careful with this. But for now, let's... Can I... 
I need to make my way to, uh, the, uh, the office, and then hopefully, uh, uh, there. I cannot speak. And uh, now, Teacher's Lounge. Or staff room. Whatever. Get that done. Talk to Nimona. I think. We have random. Okay, yeah, now I'm seriously curious about this school structure. Because I, I see extremely young students, and then I see extremely, uh, well, the students that you would expect. And then finally, then you just see, like, extremely old students. Like, as in people you wouldn't, they kind of look like they're in their, like, 20s or 30s. You don't have to give me the whole spiel, it's about the, uh, gym battles and stuff like that. Alright. So, this has been a very weird first day of school, to say the least. For now, can we just... Honestly, I think what I plan on doing is, uh, I think I'll start off with the grass gym, then work my way over to the bug gym, then maybe the water gym, I don't really know, go back down to the psychic gym, then, uh, then I guess work on, uh, work on the normal gym, ghost gym, uh, ice, uh, yeah, ice gym, and then finally finish off with the, uh, electric gym. Kind of do like a clockwork, uh, clock, uh, do it in a clockwise motion, while also knocking out everything else. Uh, while, uh, while I'm at it, take down uh, Team Star and also the ancient Pokemon. Ah, uh, great. Please, just hurry up. You only had to say it once. Uh oh, Riolu. Just never said. This is taking forever. Just at the director's office and get this over with. Also, knowing it, that because this is taking so long, I'm most likely just gonna be skipping over the uh, little shopping bit at the beginning. Oh well. Hello. Yeah, I suppose that I have. Now then, please just let me get over and get this done. Okay. But please, I do not want. I just wish to get this uh, tedious amount of a uh, tutorial-based stuff done. It's kind of weird to think that I'm like three or four episodes in, and yet I. Oh. Hello, it's Professor Chad. Okay. Uh, looks intriguing. Knowing it, uh, later on in the story, I'll most likely be forced to go there. That, or if not, then it might be a DLC area, and the, uh, later on in, uh, in the life of this game. Uh, most likely he's gonna come out of Fine. But I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to be out in buildings. You know this. Please 
Go back into your Pokeball. And I don't even know what I agreed to. I just, I just want to be able to end this. Alright. Now what? So yeah, I guess. Right, now I'm curious what he's researching. What is down in Area Zero, then? Because I've heard that it's off limits, but I just don't know what's down there. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, hey. Alright. Alright, let's go. I uh, just... Kinda looks bland. Hopefully I can decorate uh, decorate this later on. Definitely change out those bed sheets, cause honestly... That orange isn't really my color. Or is, nor is really any of the colors in this room. I'm not really sure what I painted though. Uh, yeah, well, actually, I probably wouldn't be able to paint it. But either way, with that, I'm going to be ending it here. I hope you enjoyed. Please consider liking and subscribing. Have a good day. And bye.